So in Portugal, we are working a lot with the private sector. We developed uh, several projects. We did our national plan of recovery and resilience. And one of these projects was exactly to develop a sort of regenerative farming of the ocean. We start with clams, a private company, Oceano Fresco, who is doing that. So they have a lab with two species that are under extinction. They are studying all the biologic cycle in order to generate the seeds. Now they are placing the seeds in the farm in the ocean. This farm is converted now in a sort of sanctuary. There are other species that came around. It's very, very, very stable. And this is a source of protein. So we have to replace as well our current uh, food model with the proteins produced in a very sustainable way because we are using much land uh, for cultivation and we need to, to balance that with the sea and the sea that can provide a lot of solutions including, including with seaweed. So we have a scheme with the public policies, regulation, the marine protected areas, the areas that are open to the development of the blue economy. We are also running the legislation, all the regulation procedures, but at the same time public investment combined with the, the investment from the, the, the venture capital and the, the, other, the other financial mechanisms. We are working also at the European level in order to reinforce in Europe the capital markets. We are still too weak in, in, in European terms in global in capital markets if we compare with the United States. And we need to have all these tools combined together to develop the blue economy. I think the, the Monaco, Monaco Blue Initiative and the, the leadership of His Highness Prince Albert II is very well recognized in the world. I think this is a very good initiative in order to, to bring people together, institutions, organizations, including the private sector. The private sector is very important to deploy all these initiatives. And I think for the networking, for the, 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 the knowledge about different projects and for maintaining the focus on the on the, the the blue economy and also the the, poli the politicians the, poli the polit policies to protect the ocean. This is very very important, and I think we, Portugal we cooperate a lot with Monarch. We have a relationship after the 14th century. We had our King Carlos with uh, Prince Albert the first. They were very close friends. They developed uh, this uh, passion for the ocean, and we are just. Uh, continuing this passion area, tra transferring and this passion in, into measures, policies, and the, all the things that we need to protect the ocean, and at the same time, use the ocean to generate solutions to replace the current to products, very pollutant products like, uh, like the, the fossil fuels, the plastics, the chemical fertilizer, we can replace them by biological products produced by the ocean in a sustainable way in order to change our economy and protect the seas, the oceans and the planet.